All right, I'm back with some more Bannerlord Game of Thrones. And, uh, well, the war in the north is still going on between the Wildlings and the Boltons. Ironically, the only ones not involved in the war in the north is the actual north. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, we we dealt some good blows to the uh, Boltons last time. Well, I felt we did anyway. But if I go to the kingdom thing... It actually looks like the Boltons are, uh, are better off than us. I don't know how that happened. <laughs> Prisai like always is taken prisoner by the Wildlings. Taken prisoner by the Wildlings. I don't see here the, the, the Boltons winning any fight. It must be mercenaries, man. The Boltons must have paid their way to victory. It's the only thing I can think of. There's no way naturally they just have that many. They don't even have a city. But the war with them is still ongoing. We need to recruit some troops and get up to that uh, 268. We've got a decent bit of wages, so we should be good. What did they do to my boy man's raider? He's only got 70 men. Oh boy, he was he was wandering around with like 500 when we last saw him. Richard of the Wildlings has been taken prisoner by Roose Bolton. Who the f- <laughs> Who's Richard? I, I haven't met no Richard in my life. We need to take a look here. Um, on the clans, what's our army looking like? 125 infantry, okay. And 32 of those are recruits. 60 odd, okay. Brian has now been taken prisoner. They stole Brian and Richard. Well, shit, that's a fancy looking helmet. The King's Guard. Don't know what a King's Guard helmet is doing up in the uh, in the north of like north of the wall though. But hey, it is where it is. I'll split your skull. That's a bit rude, mate. We're using blunt weapons. It's it's a friendly deal. Stand you. Dude was all like, I'm gonna split your skull. Well, oh, oh, saved by the bell. Oh, shit. Oh, what? Hang on a minute, how's this happen? Hey, lads, it's the wife. She's, uh, you alright there, love? Uh, no? Oh, shit. Oh. Oh, your team qualified. We'll take it. We'll take it. Note to self, if the wife gets knocked out, just leave her. Focus on your own tournament, Winnie. Man, it's always a spear final. Without fail, it's a spear final. Oh, jabbed him in the head for one. Jabbed him in the head for three. This dude, man. Oh, shit. Ah, ah. All right. Okay. Oh, that was a close one. That little hat that dude, that is uh, indestructible. Well, the helmet's no good to us. Maybe Herb. Herb can wear it. Herb is now our own personal king's guard. And because it's in black, it actually goes with the rest of his gear. Herb is the sworn defender of Barry. Alright, we just got the last of the recruits. We're up to 269. We go into our thing. 
was 66 ranged, 5 cav, and like 200 infantry. Of that 200 infantry, half are actually recruits. In which case, if we make, say, half those recruits ranged, so we got about 150 infantry, 100 odd ranged maybe, um, it'd be more like a 140, 110 split. We could go with that. Wildlings don't have any cavalry, so I don't have to worry about any of my men becoming cav. we got to get the cav elsewhere, which is going to be a bit of a pain. We're not far off to you. Oh, actually, no. That bar is a bit... Mi <laughs> that bar is a bit misleading. That's what we meant to say before we had a stroke there. <laughs> right. But now that we got the 269, I think we need to teach Roos Bolton another lesson. And if he keeps bothering the wildlings like he has, I won't hesitate to cut his head off. But uh, for now, we'll just pay them a visit. There we go. We got the sucker. Barry, it's been a while. Right. I do not have the authority to make peace on behalf of the Bolton. Our council should decide. Are you not the leader? Are you not the council? Okay. That's the case then, mate. We're, uh... You're just gonna have to surrender, mate. No? How many times? Footman! Are we gonna teach this fool? A lesson, you know. How many times, lads? I know how you feel. He's doing my head in as well, you know. Alright, Roos Bolton. We meet again on the field of battle. We, uh... This is, what, our third encounter? Sounds about right. Infantry! Lads, march a little further forward. Archers, get a little closer. Are they firing range yet? Can anyone see them? Nope. Alright. Infantry, march a little closer. Ranged. <laughs> there we go. Now we're firing. Alright. Who are we hitting, lads? We hitting anyone over there? Yeah. I hear a lot of shields being hit, but not a lot of uh, not a lot of killing. I say a lot of shields being hit. Ah, uh, they're blocking a fair few. They are blocking a fair few. I can't believe no one on either side has died yet. Oh, we got the first kill. Oh, someone tries shaking a she cheeky shot on us then. Oh, you son of a bitch. That's it. Lads, advance. We will march towards their lines. As one single unit, man. Said one single unit, get in line. The arrows flying overhead as we march. We got this, lads. Just hold the line. He's sent to assassinate me. Oh, God damn it. They always assassinate me. Did I just kill a horse with no rider? The men are still advancing. 
I don't blame him. We have successfully kidnapped Roos Bolton for the third time. Okay. He has actually launched the attack on us because he's got a buddy. All right. We'll teach you both a lesson. Surely them being the aggressors means they should march towards me, right? In which case, got this nice little hill. And uh, I think we'll make use of this hill. You know what, while we're waiting the 20 minutes for them to march over here, I've had a thought. We will check who Roos Bolton is mates with. We'll see if he's good mates with everyone or if... Or if He's only friends with his faction. Because if he has no friends outside of the Boltons, I'll probably just cut his head off. It's as simple as that. Just smack. Head clean off. I mean, who's going to hate us for it? The Boltons? What are they going to do? They don't have a single town. They are marching at me right now with about 250 men. But, uh, but that's not the point. Alright, they've opened fire on us. We have now opened fire on them. Kind of. Buddy, you gonna shoot? You gonna take that? He just shot you. Alright, we're gonna hide down here behind the lads. Uh... There's some casualties flying in on both sides right now. So, we're just going to kind of chill behind this wall while it all goes down. Uh, just hold the shield wall, lads. Don't be afraid. They can't penetrate a good shield wall. See, they're bouncing off the front of it, lads. Oh, shit. All right, lads. Uh, advance, lads. Push them back. You look important. Oh, shit. Who thought it was alright to stab me in the back? You, you little tin head. Just start cutting them all up. You little tin head fools. Challenging me. We love the cleanup kills, lads. Just this one guy holding back all my men. Well, that showed them, I guess. They just have a bit of cav around the place now. Just a bit annoying. Here we go. Oh! Well then. I mean, he, he showed us, eh? Just got impaled at the end there. All right, let's take a look here. Roos Bolton, who, who are you friends with? Uh, he's friends with quite a lot of people, actually. He's even friends with Mance Raider and stuff, even though, like, they're at war with each other and trying to kill each other. But the way to see it is, guys, right? We aren't... This isn't like Bandit Larry where we're soloing it. We're fighting under someone else's name. So we'll just execute everyone under their name. <laughs> Why not? It's perfect. But then again, do I really want to be ex... Oh, man. Don't know. We could strike a big blow. 
for the Boltons right now by just cutting off like Ah, you know what? We're a wildling. You know? The purpose is to get the world to hate us. It's what we do. But then a lot of houses will hate us. Oh no, what do we do? Do we just cut all their heads off? Do we not cut their heads off? Oh man. Or maybe it's like, anyone remember the Froobs advert where it's like, cut their heads off and squeeze their guts out? <laughs> no, just me. <laughs> Please tell me that was actually an advert. And I'm not going insane. I tell you what, we won't execute anyone this part. But uh, what I need you to do is, I need you all to vote. We'll put it down to a uh, community decision. Do we lash out and execute all the lords in the name of the wildlands? Take back Westeros for the true natives? Or, uh, hold up. Back it up. Bruce Bolton declares war on the north. Let me, let me just check my parties. This dude, who's chilling as my prisoner, has just gone off and declared war on someone. So, like, how? <laughs> oh, one of them's escaped. Tell you what, we'll ransom Roos for now since he's at war with them. The Night's Watch has declared war on us. <laughs> that is a bold move from Joe Mormont. Fair play. I mean, kingdoms. Where's the Night's Watch? It's just Joe Mormont. Everyone else is dead. I mean, I, I guess that is his job. His job is to keep us out, so... Makes sense. We'll, we'll have to leave it here. It's going to be a bit of a short one. But I need, I need your help. We need to vote. Do we kill every lord we capture? Is there certain factions we should kill, but not others? Let me know what houses you think need to just go. And we'll go from there. What's the renown looking like? We earned a decent bit. Okay. We earned a good chunk. Did we make Egret lead her own army again? Bloody hell, what the hell is she wearing? How'd you get all that? You're a wildling. Right, I have a quick question. Let me inspect your troops. Eat. <laughs> nah, we can't do that to her. We're not that harsh, lads. What I'll do is... I'll give a 10 of my wildlings. I'll give a 10 of my basic archers. Um... Have the sapling and the sprouts. Did not mean to give her those spears. That should be a good starting point, right? Um, she can have those. We'll keep the cavalry because I I kind of want a little bit of cavalry. But Algaris, that should be enough that bandits won't kill her. And then I guess she just starts funding the rest. So we can build up our clan a little bit. And we we can co create armies, can't we? We can. We... Does Egret cost anything because she's my wife? No. But me and Egret can team up and we can start fighting the Boltons as a duo. Maybe that's the plan. See how it works out. But the wildling army is not looking good. 
as I said, it's for you lot to decide. Do we kill or survive? That is the question. But until next time, as always, if you enjoyed, leave a like, subscribe. And until next time, see ya.